Welcome to another edition of Turbo Drive Live Let's Plays here on Twitch TV, and uh, um, hopefully by the time this actually comes out, last minute continue. Yeah, if, uh, yeah, you probably won't hear that in other things, but anyway, never mind. Um, <clears throat> how are you all doing? Uh, I'm back again uh, with uh, the spinning thing in the corner. Yes, this this the thing here. You know, this is my DS. DS capture malarkey. It cost me almost like what? Two hundred pounds? Two hundred fifty? It's quite expensive. Yes, I know. But of course, we are going to be playing something very unique because uh, here, you know, here in Turbo Drive Live Central, um, I'm a big fan of unique. Uh, games, very kind of like uh, you know thought-provoking games. Uh, that I also like. I also also like making fun of and whatnot. And what better yet than to talk about and play the DS, one of the original DS titles that came out for the system. Another code, two memories, or as it's known in the states, trace memory. Uh, I don't know why they called it trace memory. It's uh, kind of a odd thing to call it, but uh, you know, yeah, same thing. You know, uh, though they did uh, for localization pur for some bizarre reason for localization purposes, they've changed some of the names. I'll go into them, you know, um, when we actually start playing. With uh, that said, we're gonna be playing some another uh, another code two memories. Um, hopefully, no Nintendo won't sue us. Uh, or anything, because they can't sue us, because basically they closed the studio that made this game. Yes, the studio that made this game closed two or three years ago. Thanks, Nintendo. Real good work there. Uh, plus, they, you know, as obviously stuff will go down, obviously other things. Yeah. But anyway, this is my this is my DS setup. Yes, so many wires. You know, so many wires come out of the place. Um, as, and keynote people will, uh, or key people will notice that it's the uh, Zelda Special Edition that I got modified. So, uh, you know, the Zelda 3DS. So, yay. Um, but yeah. I'm just going to check who's in here. We've got Hack in the chat. Hack's in the chat. Hack the chat. Hack the chap, 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 the hat cap. Hack of the cap, tap, dip, 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 dip. Um, um, also, I did see the, I did see a Vilgax earlier, but I think he just screwed, you know, he just went off because I'm not playing any Duke, I'm not playing any Duke Nuke in 3D. Uh, um, but we got Strata and all that Jaws. It's like Jaws Hans. Uh, so yeah, so we're, let's get it started. Into play. I never could. Well, actually, you guys can hear that. Pr all right, can you? I'm not overpowering it or anything, no. Because for some reason, it's just based on how loud the thing this is, basically. Anyway, um, ah, screw it. We'll we'll go through it. it <laughs> music's not everything, right? All right. Um. So. Without further ado, this is another code, two memories, on the DS. And the screen will be shrinking just now. There you go. It shrank. It shrank. Nintendo and sing. Sing, baby, sing. 1948, Blood Edward Island. Father? Why? <laughs> no! <laughs> Words! 1994, Seattle. Ashley, quick, hide! 
No! <laughs> Mummy! <laughs> uh, and lastly, 2005, Blood Edward Rhode Island. Quite ironic, we're going full circle earlier. It's finished. Finally. Richard! Oh! <laughs> Extreme close up! <laughs> anyway, another, another code, two memories. This is it here, so. Alright, so we are going to have a new game. We're gonna have a new game. So you people get to see it. It was the day before my 14th birthday. I wasn't feeling so good. That morning, I was on a small boat heading towards Blood Edward Island. The sea was very calm, but my heart was a storm of emotion. I felt upset and happy, excited and confused. I'd never felt that way before. Of course. OF COURSE! <laughs> this was because... I had just found out... STOP USING ELLIPSES! <laughs> that my dad is alive. Ellipses. Wait! Start up! <laughs> Starting recognition in progress. Please touch the center of the ring with your index finger. Interactation! <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, I have to read what Hack said in the chat. And say, it's and say, in the opening cutscene. It's finally! They finished writing Nintendo's copyright infringement claim files! Ah! <laughs> yeah, I know. Anyway, uh... Reading. Reading complete. Hmm. Username, Ashley Mizuki Robbins. No, my name is John Turbo Finley. Shut the fuck up. Birth date, 12-11-1991. No. That's not my de that's not my age. Dear Ashley, I'll be waiting for you here on Blood Edward Island. I want to spend your 14th birthday with you, and only you, your father, Richard. P.S. Don't forget to bring milk. Duel, another system, start! Daddy? Ashley, I am God! <laughs> I have come from the heavenly light. Daddy! Well, here we are. Huh? So that's the island. Look at that animation! Yep, that's it. Don't know what your business is here. But I don't envy you. No one's come no one's come by this place for a long, long time. Just days before my fourteenth birthday, <laughs> I received a package. Inside it there was a letter from my dad from my father. Not my dad, my father. Who I thought was dead when I was three years old. Three years old. There was also a small medicine uh, machine. Sorry, not medicine. <laughs> I am now heading in that direction. He gave me in that letter, Blood Edward Island. He will be waiting for me, and I will see him again.
<laughs> Chapter 1, meet the meeting with D. Wait, the meeting with D? Oh no, sweet Jesus! It, it's uh, the Saturn game D all over again! Ah! The madness, the madness! Anyway, <clears throat> what was it? Hack saying, uh, <laughs> five, flame, five frame loop animation! Gosh, Nintendo, your skills are astounding! Actually, that's not Nintendo, that was Sing. I actually liked it back in the day. I mean, this was made back in 2005. 2004, 2005. Give it some credit. This was on the original DS as well. That animation was stunning. Anyway, let's let's start the meeting with D. Now, this is what you need to critique. This 3D 3D polygon effect. Uh, but anyway, so yeah, we got uh, control of uh, Ashley here, so... Sorry if the frame rate is a little choppy on the capture card. Anyway, let's uh, talk to... Let's talk to her. Let's, let's talk to this woman. Jessica, there you are. Ellipses. <laughs> God damn the fucking ellipses. Oh, Ashley. You're awake. Yeah. I must have fallen asleep. Yes. <laughs> Are you feeling alright? Hmm. Ellipses. Does that tell you anything? <laughs> oh, Ashley. It was that dream again, wasn't it? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Mr. Hooper again. I'm sorry. Don't want to, don't want to, you know, worry or anything. But he just can't stop strangling me. <laughs> sorry. Um, just put it out of your mind. It's not real. Just a bad dream. Uh, no. That was actually more of a memory than a dream. Idiot. <clears throat> no one remembers things that happened to them at su such a young age, you know? Don't torture yourself. Just let it go. <sighs> Jessica... Jessica's... <laughs> Jessica is Dad's little sister. And his only living family. I... I'm sure they could have fit in a, a my in there, but you know, Jessica, Jessica is my dad's little sister. But hey, you know, she teaches chemistry at college, and she basically raised me. She's a nice lady, warm-hearted. She's always been there for me. <laughs> She's always been there for me uh, to pick up the bills. <laughs> but. I can't even look at her right now. I can't believe that for all these these years she knew that dad was alive and she didn't tell me. Actually, you know, so hold on a second. Just move that microphone to the side there. God damn it. It's like moving stuff because I, I know people are hearing me pressing the A button a lot. So there we go. Okay. I think that does it. I think that'll be fine. Ashley? <laughs> yeah? We're just about there. I can see Blood Edward Island. Your father is waiting for you there. I'm sure he can't wait to see you. My dad. <laughs> so, we get to obviously questionnaires and whatnot. Uh, so, uh, you know, Dad's alive? My father's alive? <laughs> Why did you let me believe that Dad was dead? Silence is golden! <laughs> always in, always in another code. <laughs> Why? Why did you lie to me for all these years? I had to. I made a promise to your father. Promise? What kind of promise? 
I know I'm doing a very bad, bad girly girl voice impression, but I don't have a female co-host to do this shit. Okay? Stop giving me hasher. I suppose I can't tell you. I suppose I can tell you now. It happened 11 years ago. He just turned up on, on my doorstep one day with you in his arms. You had just turned three. I still remember how you looked that day. So very small. Silence. <laughs> Ellipses. It had been a while since I've seen him last. He looked tired and agitated. He just said, don't question me on this. I'll come back for her someday. Until then, take good care of her. And under no circumstances can you tell her that I'm alive. But why? Why did he say that? I have no idea. All I could sense was that something terrible was happening, or had happened. So, at his request, I took you under my wing without a word. <laughs> I took you under my wing and taught you everything you know. <laughs> to tell you the truth, I was too scared to ask any questions. I didn't want to learn anything that could have put us in danger. And now, Richard has kept his promise by contacting you. I'm sorry, Ashley. I wanted to tell you about your father, but... I made a promise. A promise that is stupid. <laughs> yeah. Can you tell can you tell me about him now? He's an excellent scientist. No duh. <laughs> a scientist? I'm sure that small machine he sent you is one of his creations. What was he researching? Memories. One bit of the title! Anyway. <clears throat> Memories? He worked on... He worked for a research lab that specialized in that field. It was there that he met a beautiful, accomplished Japanese scientist. Her name was Sayoko. She was your mother. Let's talk about the small machine first. This gadget Dad sent me. The plate on the front says DAS. Does that mean anything to you? Case in point, um, in the American version of the game, Trace Memory, they actually called it the TAS, I believe. I think they called it the TAS, I don't, or something different. I know they changed the name, because they had to change the name uh, from DAS to something else uh, to relate to the, to the title of the, of the game, so... Yeah. Uh, Someone, someone in the chat will probably tell us what, eventually. Does that mean anything to you? Das? I wonder what that means. It has a camera icon on it. It has a camera icon on it, too. Is that right? Oh, I think I just took your picture. Ah. Ah. Ah! <laughs> Let's see. Ellipses. <laughs> How can I see it? Ashley? Oh yeah, like this. Ashley, listen to me. About the DAS. What is it? You're the only person who can use it. What do you mean? Your fingerprint is registered on the DAS. It registered my, registered my fingerprint? How? <laughs> With touchscreen technology! No, it's, it's, it's stupid. <laughs> it's like finger recognition. It's too bad this doesn't ha uh, like the DS doesn't have true finger recognition or anything like that. <clears throat> it's all based on biometrics. How do you know this? Biometrics? It's a system that reads human physical characteristics and cross-checks them with previous registered data. Your DAS has this installed. Therefore, no one else can use your machine, only you. That's kind of that's kind of neat. Okay, but seeing that if 
she if Ashley, you know, unlocked the DAS and whatnot, couldn't someone just, you know, take it off her and just continue you know, use it while it's unlocked or something like that? I think that's the whole thing of biometrics. It kind of like locks out things and then it kind of unlocks when the registered user uses it and then it stays unlocked or something. I don't know. You know. I'm sure it's not like it's got a system. It's, it's not like it's got a security system where if an unreg unregistered hand touches it, it gives them an electric shock of like 20 billion volts. You know, it fries them. <laughs> nah, I don't think so. It's a pretty advanced feature. Richard must have had something very important to say to you. He sent you the DAS to make sure that you were uh, that you alone can access it. Oh, <laughs> how convenient! <laughs> Jessica, could you also tell me something about Mom? Well, I don't know where to start. I didn't know her very well. Sayoko was a brilliant scientist, very strong-willed, and she had had these beautiful dark eyes. You definitely have her eyes, Ashley. Yep. <laughs> Everyone, it's always in the eyes. <laughs> no, you you know what I mean. <laughs> Stop pussyfooting around. I want to know what happened to her. Is she alive? I I don't know. A <laughs> Yeah, I. She's alive. Of course, she's alive. Not in the open. Yeah, the opening segment. Yes, I. She's totally alive after that. Dumbasses. <clears throat> Please, Jessica, just tell me the truth for once. I'm sorry. No matter what, I'll stay calm. Where did that come from? Okay. I promise I won't get mad. I just want to know about Mom. Oh, Ashley. You told me she died when I was three as well. She's still alive, isn't she? Oh, pfft. Okay, if she was... If you told her she's dead, she's dead, okay? Okay, she, okay fair enough, she lied about the father. Yeah, fair enough, but... You know... Lying about both of them? No! You can't lie about both! Oh, jeez. I bet she's on that island with Dad. Tell me, Jessica. Calm down. Calm down, Ashley. Calm down. It's only a commercial. When we arrive... When we arrive, speak to your father. When you see him, I'm sure he'll explain everything. Jessica. Alright, so now that we've talked about everything, we can continue the game. Land ho! I know he's. I know I should be more sailor esque with him, but uh, nah. Redneck, you know, has to be. The captain has docked the boat. We're, moor we're moored alongside a small pier. I don't see Dad anywhere. Where could he be? As a matter of fact, I can't. St to, sorry, I think this is I think this is uh, you know, Jessica talking. As a matter of fact, I can't can't see anyone around here at all. Don't you ladies don't you ladies have anyone to come and get you? I'm sorry to say I can't stay here with you. No chance. No chance in hell. I gotta leave before nightfall, no matter how much you pay me. And I don't mean it's like in stupid you know, internet money or anything like that. YouTube money doesn't cut anything for me. That's Nintendo's stick. Nintendo can fuck themselves. They can have as much n YouTube money as they want. I don't want a dime. <laughs> this is where he said to meet him, right? Why isn't he here? Hmm. Very strange. He must be waiting for us somewhere else. Come on, Ashley, let's go and have a look for him. You go. I'm staying here. Don't be difficult, Ashley. I'm not being difficult! I'm not being it's, it's my birthday and I cry if I want to! <laughs> I wanted all this time and tr 
I waited all this time and traveled all this way to meet him, and he can't even come and meet me? Ellipses. All right, Ashley, you wait here. I'll go and look for him. If I don't find him nearby, I'll be right back. Don't wander off, okay? Jessica. So, Jessica! <laughs> right, okay, so we got control of uh, Ashley now, and, well, we can only talk to this guy because he's, he'll, you know, <clears throat> scold us for, uh, you know, going off and whatnot. So let's talk to him. Why a long face, kid? You look real down. I'm fine. Is she your mother? <laughs> no. Stepmother? No, she's my aunt. My dad's sister. But she's the one who raised me, so she's like a mother, I guess. See, dad left me with Jessica when I was just a little kid, and... Hey, hey, kid, calm down. I don't, I don't need to know all the details. You don't need to tell me your life story, all right? I mean, I've got five, five, five children at home needing to be, needing to be fed, and my, and, and my, uh, you know, my wife left me, you know, for, for some hot, hot guy in the wrestling business. I don't care what you think, all right? So shut the fuck up. Oh, sorry. That uh, damn straight. <laughs> Anyway, whoever this lady is, whoever this lady is to you, hmm. Need, need a silence. You do look pretty, pretty sad when she's gone. She's fine. She'll come back. She'll come right. And she'll be coming right back. She's she's coming right. Oh uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. It makes sense. She's coming right back. No problem. No problem. No problem. Okay. And you won't mind if I wait for her with you. That's <laughs> a <It's>, uh, awkward. <laughs> I guess I am a little worried about Jessica. It's all Dad's fault. He he should have come. <laughs> hey, kid. <laughs> yeah. We could always just talk to pass the time. Okay, I guess. Can I ask you some questions about yourself and this island? Go ahead. If there ain't too if it ain't too complicated mind. What? I'm sorry, I'm trying to read that again. He said if they ain't too complicated all right, mind. Okay. Yeah, right. I think that makes sense since <laughs> my brain's trying to wrap around that <laughs> that sentence. Okay. No problem. <laughs> he Okay, let's talk about the captain. When did you become a captain? Way before you were born. Wow, that's a long time. <laughs> yep. <laughs> did you want to be a captain ever since you were a little boy? Well, what do you think? Possibly you wanted to be something else. Perhaps my memory ain't as good as it was. It has been a long time. Hmm. When people grow up, do they all forget about the past? Maybe. I reckon some do. Yeah, I'm I'm a forgetful sob, me. I can't even remember why I ate last week. Ha <laughs> ha. But don't worry, kid. People only forget what they want to forget. What if they what if you want to remember? Just keep repeating it to you keep just keep repeating it in your head. You won't forget. I see. By the way, do you come to this island often? Nope. This is the only. This is this is only my second time. Not many people want to come here. You see, I sure don't. The last time I came out here was a good while back. I was I was accompanied by a tall blonde fellow. What? A tall blonde man? When? What? What was his name? Why, what's it to you? That man, he could have been my dad. Your dad? Huh. Yes, so did you, 
Sorry, kid. I'm not allowed to give information out out about any of my customers. <laughs> it's strictly confidential. Oh. So, pass passenger captain confidentiality and all that. Sorry, sorry, kid. I'll just hold up my keys for the lock <laughs> and my safe where I keep all my files. <laughs> Blood Edward, let's talk about Blood Edward Island. Blood Edward Island. That a creepy place. <clears throat> this island's pretty much empty, isn't it? Yep. Was it always this way? Or did people ever live here? You're a curious one, aren't you? I guess so. I suppose. Well, before your, before my old father died, he once told me that this island used to be owned by a rich family, the Edwards. That's why they called it Blood Edward Island. Oh, back then it was just called Edward Island. Now it's called Blood Edward Island because there was a murder happening here. Spooky murder. Oh, everyone died. Blood ran red. Seas ran red. Blood. I'll die. Yeah, that's why they call it Blood Ed Edward Island now. <laughs> yeah. But then the master took sick, and bad things started to happen. What kind of bad things? One by one, family members just started to die. Don't know why. Don't know why they started to die. Perhaps they were high. <laughs> Perhaps they were high. Who knows? What do you mean they start to die? How did they die? To be honest, I'm not sure. That has never really been made clear. Maybe that... Maybe there was an accident. Hey, kid. How old are you? Thirteen. I'll be fourteen tomorrow. Well, there's... There's still too young to... <laughs> well, sorry. Well, there's... That well, but it's that. I think I'm saying theirs, but that's. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's still too young to be filling it, your head with grizzly ideas. You shouldn't be. You shouldn't go thinking about age at your. Uh, you shouldn't be going thinking about death at your age. I mean, look at that poor sod of a character called Gohan. He had to deal with death so many times, and he was only fucking four, <laughs> or seven, or whatever the fuck his age was when he started in Dragon Ball Z. I never watched it that much. Too crazy Japanese animation there. Can't handle. <laughs> Silence. <laughs> well, anyways, after all that, the rest of the family left the island. Since then, and I co totally didn't mean to skip that in line. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. Folks dubbed the island Blood Edward. The name, the name stuck ever since. I see. By the way, what's your father's what's your father doing on this island? Uh what's he doing? Well I don't know, let's see. I don't know. What's he I don't know what's he doing here. I guess I'll find out soon. I see. So who is your father? What does he do? Jessica told me he's a scientist. <laughs> a scientist, eh? Sounds like he must be pretty smart. Yes, he's Cave Judson! <laughs> I guess. I don't really know him. You're a bright young lady. You must must take after him. Yeah? Yes. Very... Inquensive. <laughs> what the fuck? I'm sorry. I, I can't remember what that word is. Oh. Inquisitive. Inquisitive, I think it is. Let me say. Very inquisitive, I'd say. So be careful, okay? <laughs> what do you mean by that? I don't think that there has to be a logical explanation for everything. Ah, yes, sir. Right. Okay. So that's all we can talk from him. So, so we have an extra cutscene to continue the plot. Hmm. Your aunt is taking a while, ain't she? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yes, yes. Yes. I'm getting a bit worried. 
I'll go and look for her. No, please, I'll go. You sure now, Missy? I'm sure. She must have found Dad. They must have lost track of time talking somewhere. I'll go and find them. Okay. Here, take these with you. Tch. I got... S <laughs> I got sweets from the captain. Yay, sweets! Thanks. I love sweets. Don't tell your aunt. Gotcha. Be careful, kid. I will. Right, so let's uh let's ship out and see what we can do. <clears throat> I can't see anyone. Where are they? Right, okay, so Of course there's obviously certain moments in uh in the in the kinda like uh game where you can view places. So obviously you can look at uh different stuff like look at this tree the tree is huge the branches seem to fill the sky and you can also see the boat I can see the boat where <laughs> I can see the boat where we were on ba -ba -ba -ba. grass grows grass grows wild below the tree <laughs> alright I think that's enough sightseeing uh, I think there's also a yeah, you can also open up your inventory and stuff like that. Uh, you can also take a picture if you want, of course. Um, oh, so we get, get some racks. <laughs> There's a big rock. <laughs> that's a that's a very big rock. Yeah, sorry, it's just, it's, I'm just the screen's a little dirty. <clears throat> Uh, so that's a giant rock. That's a big rock. That's a lot of fish. Anyway, there was a uh, what was it? There was a bridge to the island. Jessica, Jessica must have gone this way. Jessica, you said you'd come back right back. Did you manage to find Dad? came from the other side. It sounded like that was Jessica's voice. What happened? I better go find her. What's that? Oh no, the drawbridge. bridge. Oh, the drawbridge bridge is up. Jessica. I've got to get to the other side fast. Oh. Uh, well, we can't cross it, so let's let's search places. Oh, we can go around the tree. Anyway, well, let's look at this, shall we? Let's look at the drawbridge and let's look at this. Ooh, I wonder what this is all about. <clears throat> the machine is rusted. What's that handle for? Let's take a l closer look, shall we? Uh, you can also double tap, uh, or quickly tap, or continuously tap an area, and then it will obviously uh, talk about the description and whatnot. Under the machine is a pal palette. There's nothing written on it. Okay. This handle. Maybe if I minigame <laughs> Right, so let's Puzzles for the win! <laughs> right, that's what I still liked about this game is that obviously in it, it was kind of like your typical adventure game and whatnot. So it was all good. Woo! I love that little sound effect. Woo! It's like someone would go, Woo! 
Yeah, you completed the puzzle! Yes, the bridge, the drawbridge is down. I can now get across. And all that. Right, let's get across. Mm -hmm.